Youth Olympic Games in Gongwan. It is the mass start final. 16 contenders. And here they are. Jessica Rodriguez. Portugal, Jessica Rodriguez. People's Republic of China, Yunqi Liu. Jungkook, Liu Yunqi. Japan, Kaede Kojima. Japan, Kojima Kaede. Norway, Martin Sola. Norway, Martin Sola. People's Republic of China, Xiao Hanjiang. Jungkook, Zhang Xiaohan. Italy, Georgia Franceschini. Italia, Georgia Franceschini. Kazakhstan, Alina Shimekova. Kazakhstan, Alina Shimekova. Japan, Waka Sasabuchi. Japan, Sasabuchi Waka. Austria, Janine Rosner. Austria, Janine Rosner. United States of America, Marley Solden. Vigo, Mari Solden. Italy, Noemi Liberaleso. Italia, Noemi Liberaleso. Kazakhstan, Kristina Shimekova. Kazakhstan, Kristina Shimekova. Poland, Sofia Brown. Poland, Sofia Brown. Poland, Hanna Mazur. Poland, Hanna Mazur. So, 16 players will be able to win the title. So, that's our 16 contenders then. The number one contender is wearing the number one helmet. Just coming into view there, Angel Dalaman of the Netherlands already gold medalist in the individual 500, gold medalist in the 1500, bronze in the mixed relay. Is she going to cap the long track speed skating tournament here with another? the gold. She is the favorite, but Liu Yunqi of China, Kaede Kojima of Japan, Zhang Xiaohan of the People's Republic of China also will be strong contenders. No Korean representation here. The Republic of Korea, two skaters failing to qualify. And it's all about, of course, the intermediate points. There will be points for the first three after four laps, after seven laps. Then the big points come in at the end of the tenth and final laps. Okay. So that's when this race is going to be won and lost. But all eyes on Angel Dalaman on the inside. She's got Yasmin Van Hoos of... Uh, also, the Netherlands tucked in right behind her as well with Jessica Rodriguez of Portugal, the real surprise qualifier here. Had a superb skate and showed really good tactical awareness to pop up out of nowhere on that final bend to secure her place. She tucks into third, but it'll all be slow and steady and uh, nobody's going to be in any rush to make any kind of move early on here unless somebody does spring a surprise and Dalaman is certainly capable of that she's happy front running she's the fastest skater in this field everybody knows that if she wants to front run and go for it she could unlikely a little stumble at the back there and uh, no damage done there for Martin Solem but uh, maybe a sign of the uh, jangling nerves but at the moment in this mass start women's final it's uh, double Dutch, Dalaman and Veenhuis, one and two. An attack is coming from the Polish pair. We've just taken closer order. That's a Hannah Mazur, who's a medalist, a bronze medalist. Mazur in the 1500 meters, so she's got some pedigree. And Zofia Brown, those two working very much as a team on the outside there, but still tucked in towards the back, and still it's Dalaman and Veenhuis. And still Rodriguez in third place, but everybody bunched up here with Zhang Xiaohan, the uh, lead skater here representing the People's Republic of China. Liu Yunqi is uh, hidden away down in the pack there somewhere. She will be one of the serious medal contenders as well as Dalaman decides, well, 
Maybe it's time to just stretch this out a little bit. The one, two, three have been in place right from the get-go with Zhang tucked in just behind them. And there's the bell. And when are we going to see the attack? And where is it going to come from? The two Italians have put themselves in a good position. Liberalesso and Franceschini working as a partnership. The two Kazakhstan twin sisters are separated here. They can't work together. And uh, it's a slow sprint here. Dalaman still looking around to see where the attack is coming from. And it's not coming. Well, this is going to be some almighty attack off this bend. And here we go. Dalaman continues to lead Vainhus from Rodriguez. But how is this going to play out? Rodriguez, the Portuguese skater, going for it. And here goes Rodriguez. And she's going to pick up points. That's a big attack coming as well from the United States. Marley Soldan timed her attack beautifully. But uh, Jessica Rodriguez of Portugal uh, continuing to raise eyebrows here. A surprise finalist has just popped up and pinched three points just like that after the first sprint. Soldan timed her move to, to uh, perfection. Dalaman taking the one point. But remember, the real damage is done on the third and final sprint. Nevertheless, always nice to have points in the bank. And, uh, a lovely attack there from uh, Jessica Rodriguez. Oh, we might see a move from the... Uh, Polish skaters, that didn't happen. Zhang of the People's Republic of China is still in, uh, in a very good position, and there's been no move at all here from Liu Liung Qi, who is very much at the back. The uh, 1500 silver medalist and the gold medalist in the mixed relay yesterday, she's certainly biding her time. Balaman continues to front run, and she's got Vainhus right alongside her. I wonder if they do have something lined up tactically as we're seeing one of the uh, Shumakova twins making a move there. I think that's Christina. And Rodriguez has been a little bit left behind here, the Portuguese skater, but it's all getting a bit uh, bumpy and fractious in there. Everybody stays upright. Dalaman staying right out of trouble, and Vane, who's tucked in her slipstream. And uh, then it is Alina Shumakova. In third place at the moment, as everybody starts to bunch a little bit closer. Here's one of the Polish skaters coming around as well. Everybody seems to be making a move. There's a, an attack on the outside for one of the Italian skaters as well. I think that's Libra Lesso and uh, hitting the front here. Is uh, one of the Italians. But the two Dutch skaters are still very, very much in this as uh, Georgia Franceschini leads them around. Points picked up by Zofia Brown, who's timed her moves. She just got ahead of Dalaman there, and Soldan taking another really good point. But now we're at the business end of this. And it is still Dalaman and Vainhus leading the way. Alina Shumakova right behind them. Hannah Mazura, Poland. Has taken much closer order now here, the 1500 meter bronze medalist. She's right in the mix, and here we go. This is going for goal time, and two go down. Oh my goodness me, that's Mazur and Shumakova. Alina Shumakova goes with her as well. Oh, what a shame. They were in such good shape. It leaves the Dutch pair front running here. Now, can Vainhus stay with her compatriot and finally making a move? And it's a big move is Liu Yung Ki of uh, the People's Republic of China. But Vainhus skating smart here, sticking right with Dalaman. But Angel Dalaman is going to take this. Vainhus is going to hang on for second. And a big attack from Liu Yung Ki. Should be enough to see her secure the bronze medal. But what about that? Double Dutch delight in the women's mass start. Well, Dalaman was a strong favourite for gold as well, but uh, Yasmine Vainhus and her worked perfectly in tandem. I mean, they couldn't have, they could not have skated better. They led from the front, and even though they let the intermediary skate that uh, um, sprints get away from them, they didn't care about that. It was all about getting it right when it really mattered, and they could not have skated better. It was indeed Liu who uh, secured third place. 
with uh, a really good skate from uh, Zofia Brown, who will just miss out on a medal. Zhang will uh, settle for fifth place. Jessica Rodriguez, a sixth place finish for the Portuguese skater. How about that? Marley Soldan and Janine Rosner rounding out the top eight. But uh, it's all about Dutch delight here. Angel Dalamant with her fourth medal from four events here at the Gang Young Oval. Three of them gold. She took a bronze in the mixed relay with Sem Sprout. But uh, what a goal from her. And what an extraordinary silver from Yasmin Vainhus as well. Got to feel sorry for Hannah Mazur and Alina Shumakova who had that coming together down that home straight when they were handily placed. I'm not sure they would have taken a medal the way Liu timed her run to perfection. And by the way, that's a third medal of these long track speed skating performances from her three out of four is pretty handy as we take another look at uh, how this unfolded and there's the uh, pushing and shoving with uh, Shumikova and uh, Soldan getting involved and then Alina Shumikova and that's the collision and down goes Shumikova and down goes Mazur who is absolutely furious you can see and uh, her medal through no fault of her own her chances are gone and she would have been a contender but uh, with her departure that left it wide open for Liu who would have been thinking I can get a silver here but no Yasmin Vainhus stayed in the slipstream and that was enough to get her over the line into second place alongside Angel Dalaman what a perfectly worked one two tactically perfect no other word for it well, we'll await uh, confirmation of everything because whenever there's a bump and a crash things do have to get looked at it's uh, Liu wearing the number four helmet celebrating with Zhang good to see her taking her teammate around with her there That's all smiles from Jessica Rodriguez. What a wonderful sixth place skate from her as well. Well, now we're going to get that confirmation. And there it is. Netherlands 1, Netherlands 2. And uh, it's uh, Liu taking the bronze medal. Sophia Brown just missing out.